Welcome Pisces to your love reading for the next two days of the 26th and 27th of 2018 of September. Alright, so let's see what's going on with you. So the energy of person that might be coming towards you. So dealing with somebody in a relationship, married, or um, just trying to get to know somebody. So what might they be bringing towards you, Pisces? So they have a decision to make, alright? They're either trying to communicate, uh, trying to make a wise choice, or... Um, sometimes if you have given them no other choice but to make a decision to disconnect or whatever um, I feel like that's what they are contemplating alright um, what is your response to that particular person you're not happy uh, with them or the connection either in a marriage or in a relationship you're not really happy with how things might be going so I feel like um, if you're emotionally unfulfilled i feel like that's a uh, where you might be breaking down or choosing to go through it with a divorce um or breakup all right what might their response be pisces so it feels it seems like they want to work things out with you in some way and even if that's not the case they might uh, move on um you might feel like they uh, feel better as you both disconnect in some way but it seems like they want uh, something to work out between both of you so um, usually this is where um, people are kind of knowing about the connection where the family might be involved or others um, friends might know about the connection in some way so it does look good but um, we shall see what is your response Pisces, for the next two days so you may be having fun, you know, playing, um, playing, you know, involving yourself with others, um, sometimes social events, sometimes just deciding to be friends with somebody, um, someone that you may have been interested in and being around children as well. So be open to uh, being spontaneous, um, having a good time and maybe just uh, keeping things lighthearted. All right. And then what is the potential outcome between both of you? So um, you have fire signs showing up, but maybe a child as well. It just depends. So. There's a potential outcome between you and your love interest partner. So there's a, some kind of disappointment um, where you might be closed off towards you and them. I mean, it says <laughs> closed off. Well, both of you may be closed off towards one another. Clarify the two of swords for your partner, the love interest. So they might have something else going on with them. Sometimes bad choices being made um, and them having to make a certain change either between you, something that you've either done or something that they may have been doing and it may have been bringing about some uh, disappointment with you. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune in reverse for partner. So they may have another, well this is a um, Capricorn Virgo Taurus or energy of um, needing to focus on their career finances and that might not be uh, something that they're willing to or that they're really making good change and strides towards so that might be an issue um, so literally a person or an energy there so clarify the ten of cups in reverse for Pisces so if you have Aries here or a father that you might be around but it's the energy of trying your best to um, make sure that you're being treated right things are being done right or that this there's, there's a there's an element of growth and uh, determination and I feel like a lot of you if you feel like there's not some structure with the connection you might just be moving on and moving away from that particular person all right you clarify the ace of cups in reverse for Pisces so um, it seems like both of you might be if you make a decision to just move away from somebody this is you just uh, bringing justice into your world because you feel like that's what needs to happen you are either disconnected from somebody um, and then maybe taking things slow with somebody new or just taking things uh, slow as you heal and disconnect from something all right um, and that's what I feel and there could be legal matters or court matters one two three you have uh, three major arcanas and you have the two of swords and then you have the um, the ace of cups so there does seem to be a decision uh, that's going on between you and somebody so let's see other energies for Pisces the next two days you're yeah, definitely feeling a bit down or somber about something or someone someone is not being honest uh, someone is getting away with something all right not being honest about their feelings or honest about not having feelings or just hiding them you know and not being sincere and there could be again money things going on someone may be in a connection 
to take money from you, to get money from you, or that they can't really get themselves together uh, when it comes to career. Um, and either you go and see this person, or this person is, you know, back and forth seeing somebody else, um, and you know about it. Yeah, and it seems like this person even. You're not being quite honest about uh, about certain things, and that's why I feel like it's a decision that they have to make, um, because you may have already made a decision. It's three, 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 all right now. So there may be some synchronicities that you might run into. I feel like when it happens, that that the messages may be important for many of you out there. So um, just keep that in mind. We're gonna look into uh, a few cards here from the Romance Angels for Pisces. Next two days. Uh, getting to know each other says as you reveal your animal selves to each other your bond does deepen uh i believe uh scorpio may have had that as well uh, for some and um maybe even leo i'm not sure um but i feel like that's still part of you you know taking your time to get to know somebody and seeing if this is uh something that's true something that you would like to really um deepen uh between you and somebody else and taking your time doing it and then we have Keep an open mind. Your soul may be different from your usual type and expectations. So, um, whether or not you believe that this is something that can last because of how you two just don't really agree on certain things and maybe expectations of a certain person or how they might be, um, how you met them, um, things that keep you apart, the things that might pull you pull you apart <laughs> in some way. So um, it just depends there. So hope that the messages did help out in some way. Lots of love, lots of light, tons of feeling vibes as well. And also, you know, keeping open mind is um different rates, you know, ethics, backgrounds, sometimes sexuality, things that pull you together. And you might not feel that that particular person is your soulmate because of your beliefs around that. So um it just depends though. But um I wish you the best and uh, have a great um well, rest of the week, the next two days, but uh, I might be back uh, during the weekend. Not sure. So have a good one.